Welcome back for game two on a Saturday. Game three of the series. When the they underlined, highlighted, whatever you want to call it. Oklahoma, this pitching staff, whenever they get ahead and counts, they tend to be successful. They fall behind. You see that what happens gets the walk. Season and Sid Sanders at first. There's a fly ball to left. Boone has a beat on it. One away. Rally out left. Jada Coleman in center. And for the first time this season, Alina Torres gets a start. Back has been a tough one, but one that has been worth it. Popped into foul territory. Torres makes the play. Lena Torres looking like she's done that a time or two, two away. Obviously, hate it for fans that we're going to try to get here on Sunday as Flores lifts one to right field. Torres, how you feeling, Alina? How about that? Makes a couple of plays. I'll tell you more about the shift and the uh, in the nine hole behind the plate for an injured Kinsey Hansen. The 0-2 is locked into left center field because of course it is. Jada Coleman off to the races, slides in safely with a leadoff double. Jada Coleman not quite getting that pop-up slide. I think she wanted to make sure that she stuck her foot in close. James, Tiare's dad, good to see Nacio back in town. Here's the 1-0. Line drive deep to center field, but arranging Mack to make the play is Wachendorf. Coleman is able to tag it easily. Rita was up, bases loaded, ripped one over to third base. Infield was in just like they are now. Ball four. Oh, reaching it two away. Ella Barker does the job with two outs because of course she does. One zip sooner, suitors on a first pitch ground ball back up the middle from the freshman Ella Parker. It does not make sense for them to be pinched in almost as there's a force at the play at the plate. Parker's off the throws not even going to be close. Add to that team lead in stolen bases Ella Parker. Parker stands at second with two outs. Sooners up one zip. The three two to Sanders. Foul tip, inning over. Ella Parker with a two out RBI single. And as we head to the second inning. About that time of year when a lot of teams around campuses, seasons winding up, conference mm. tournaments happening. That's gonna fall. I mean, a nice little piece of hitting by Coyasos. And Alina Torres was backed up of confidence. I wouldn't say her pitches look so much different, but her confidence and her presence on the mound to me looked very different. Rito's going to go to second. Oh, safe. Good thread here. Maybe the best thread of the day. And a slap right at Brito. Pick up the ball, Riley. Bases are loaded with nobody out. That was a little small ball. Work to perfection. Here for Zadie Lavalley. She loops one in a shallow right field. We'll have a play at the plate potentially. No! Look at Alina Torres showing off the arm in right field. What a way. Simple. Twig and a miss. Calm, cool, collected, confident. Kirsten Deal. One's it. Ground ball to second. Good job by Hodge. They'll get the force, and that'll do it. Big fist pump from Sid Sanders. Seemed like a statement half inning there, Mindy. Game one earlier, 12 to three in run rule fashion. They're up one zip in the bottom of the second. Boom, a little harder bunt. The throw by Coyasso is right on time. And there's one away. Little bit too much. A little bit more zip than we saw in game one. Full count pitch, ball four. Third base runner for the Sooners, first walk. Game one today. Three runs batted in in the two previous games. The 3 1 pitch, ball four. And that turns the lineup over. Look out. That is your goal as a nine hole. The pitch. Don't know if she got all of that. Center field. Lockendorf under it. Makes a catch inning over. Sooners threaten again. They've stranded three. One up. 
This one could be trouble. Torres ranging back, racing over. She looks like a pro out there. One away. Deal in danger of putting her aboard here. Ball four. Umpire calls that one high. Deal, she wants. No balls in a strike. Ooh, that's a wild pitch. And off to second goes Govan. Ace, that creates a ton of momentum in the Baylor dugout. The 3 2. She went. Oh! Jen Rocha pops out of the dugout. And that's a rarity. No balls in a strike. To the right side, what a play by Hodge. She'll try to get to second, took her time, made the play at first. You are very picky with the pitches you're wanting to swing at. Ball four. Bases loaded, all three runners. I'm gonna see her go coast to coast. Oh, she got her! Cold strike three on the outside corner. Deal shows and an unusual amount of emotion as she... 2-2. Two, two. Line drive, right center field, up the alley. Get on your horse, Tiari Jennings. A stand-up double. And as she has done her whole career, out call. And she just absolutely demolishes a ball. Way out of here. An absolute burrito bomb. And she is fired up as she rounds the bases. And she should be. That thing was tattooed. And it's three nothing Sooners on maybe the deepest burrito bomb of there with the one two pitch. Oh, foul tip. One away. Good pitch. That one. Pretty good answer from Crandall. That was more of. <laughs> Ooh, Sanders just got under that 2-1. A little bit more dramatic on the catch than maybe I thought for Coyasos. Coyasos calling off her shortstop. But Should be a play for Coyasso who overran it, but still might makes the catch and stays on her feet. Thought she might tumble there, but a good job by Sid Coyasso. So Sooners add two and that's it. We head to the fourth. Oklahoma on top of Baylor, three zip. First pitch swinging, Zadie LaValle pops it into left field. Riley Boone is, and there's one away. Just a, a word to, and by the way, appreciate all the shout outs. We're gonna get to him coming up throughout the broadcast. My man's having him quite a summer. <laughs> Here's stud, Cole. Grandpa's the best. The 2-2 pitch popped up. Who's got it? Alina Torres says, I do. Two away. Lineup turns over to Emily Hot. Oh, Hot got a hold of one. Deep to left. Boone racing back. Oh, it's gone. Emily Hot have a weekend. Another home run, this time an oppo shot. And it's three to one Sooners. In a big celebration from the Bears at home plate. Emily Hot, man, she has been on a tear. She takes this curveball from Deal. They have learned so many tough lessons already. There's trouble in the left field. No, what you have? Riley Boone! Full extension dive for Riley Boone, and that'll do it for Baylor. Marissa and Eric Colquinn at the Gulf of Mexico. How about that? Alina Torres! center field stay hot Alina unbelievable streak and the suitors get back the run they gave up it's four to one it's the second leadoff homer of the game for the Sooners math there's a soft slap to third Coyasos just in time uh, fall a steal Fall a steal. Talk about a streak. Boy, Ludlam just 
having a tough at bat here. Would be, could be, or should be ever low. It's going to be close play at first. The throw, got it. Inning over, but the Sooners strike back after giving up a run on an Emily Hot home run at the top of the third, uh, top of the fourth. <laughs> Leadoff hitter hitting 212 against her. It's played by Brito, one away. The can say she wasn't our ace until World Series. Yeah. So you never know. Oh, just under the glove of T.R. Jennings in the center field. T.R., you could sense the frustration right away. One. Here's the 0-1. Line drive right at Jennings hitting over. How about that? Carly Keeney works around the one-out air and retires the Bears and Orange is due to hit one to the moon here if she puts it near the plate. Like that. Out of here. Home run, Tiari Jennings on an absolute line over the left field wall. And Tiari does it again. It is now 5-1 to one, Oklahoma. Rito hit one that got out of here in a hurry her last time up. And boy, Koyasos has been so good at third. One away. I also had that moment where. Pole just jutting out. <laughs> I was wondering how you were going to describe that. I, I I'll take pole. Thinking. All four. <laughs> <laughs> but it fits. It is. A big. Well, I their stance on the back, a better way to put it. Pickering gets a hold of one. Deep to left field, but not deep enough. Two away. The Sooners are in danger of really bringing down the overall average run total. Mistakes, those were the ones that were hit hard. Oh, Boone wore it. Home plate umpire, I think, said she had thrown. <laughs> Riley Boone trying to dodge out of the way of that incoming ball. <laughs> the 3 2 pitch to Torres. Hard hit ball into center field. It's a base hit. Patty Gasso waves home Ella Parker. She slides in safely. Stay hot. Alina Torres. Run here. On. Ends it. Did she check her swing? She did not. Patty Gasso can. Breathe a sigh of relief as Kinsey Hansen walks back. For them, that is what they have been searching for so far this season. Nice play, staying down on it. A little kind of double clutch from Hodge, but there's one away. T.R.A. Jennings. First pitch, grounder right side by La Valley. What doesn't Alina Torres do? She's... <laughs> Talk about vocal cues right there. Base hit. Aaliyah Benford gets it past to diving Alyssa Brito. Hey. Perfectly in that 5-6. Uh, almost looked like it was going to graze her thighs before it broke back over the plate. No balls and a strike. Ooh, a hitter. <laughs> the ball, two strikes, two away. Two on. Uh-oh. Deep to right field. Boone watches it thud off the wall. Coleman retrieves it. They'll throw into second. No play at home. It's a two-run, two-out double from Presley Pylon. And the Sooners' lead is cut in half. It's six to three. Massive swings. This could be trouble. Shallow right field. Boone off the hop. The throw to the plate. Look out. Six to four, Govan's off to second. Right there, Oklahoma looking scattered. I think. She won earlier today. Here's the one-two pitch. Popped up on the infield. There you go, Kelly Maxwell. Baylor, though, comes clawing back as the Bears tend to do. He's from UCF with a four to two. 1 0 to Lilio. Hit her. Ouch. And then it got our home plate. I think that got everyone. That got Q. Watching staff, it was the offense that I was. Mm. First pitch swinging. Gina loops one deep to left field. It hits off the wall. 
Q is on her way to third. Jada in with a double. Oklahoma looks to strike back. And Jada took one nearly out of here. True. Here's the one two to TRA. That sounded so pure off the bat. It's a pop up on the infield. One away. West makes the play. Here's Alyssa Brito. She's homer tonight. Semester early. That's right. You got to play with Sid Romero, Keith Clifton. Hopped up, shallow right field could be trouble and falls. Q Lilio scores on the bloop single from Alyssa Brito. Oklahoma gets one back. It's seven to four. You got to leave your feet for that one. Maya Bland is off to second. She's the pinch runner that checked in and she'll steal the bag is <laughs> an absolute cannon of a throw from Laval. This is who you want up clutch consistent. Bounce to the right side. Coleman's coming home. All right, she'll get in a pickle. Parker will head to second. She's still in the baseline. She's going to get back to the bag. She's going to get back to the bag. Now they're chasing Bland. Now Bland's in a rundown between second and third, and they're going to tag her. <laughs> That's what happens whenever you're too fast at second and third, but not on, especially as season goes on, conference goes on, teams find their identity. Mm, cool. Pops this one up in a foul territory. Govan makes the catch, and that'll do it for the Sooners in the sixth. They get a run back. And those who have stuck around, stuck around have been rewarded today with some fun softball. Ground ball to short. Smooth. One away. Of an inning. The 3 2. This could be trouble. No, not with Elena Torres over there. Two away. Sooners are one out away. <laughs> one ball, one strike. To center field. That's Jada Country. And that's ball game. Oklahoma sweeps the series from Baylor. The final score on a Saturday night in Norman. Tuesday night. And then Kansas is no joke this year in the Big 12. Final thoughts. What do you take away from today's sweep and the overall series sweep for the Sooners? Oklahoma, they look good. They look like they are cruising through these games.